Hey people, I'm just going to do a refresher on uh, on the Amazon uh, native shopping ads uh, because a lot of things have changed since the last time I've done this so I'll just do a, an update and if it's the first time I'll just uh, greetings to you. Anyhow, I'll, um, so what I've done, I've, I don't need to change that. I've, I, before I done this video, I just collected. I made up a, a, piece, a PC store, and I grabbed a tracking code and I put it on my notepad. And I'm just doing the Apple one now. So now, so you built your store, you got your products. Well, this is not a store. This is a bit different to store. Um, we're just doing uh, native shopping ads tonight. Oh, so let's move on. Um, so we're in our Facebook section here and we need to get Thunder Penny. Okay, that's come up. So static HTML Thunder Penny. Type that in and what you need is the app just to click on uh, user app okay so you'll get to choose your page um, add that to your page add page tab to your Facebook page and it'll come up here as welcome we'll fix that up so click on edit TAB and then hit static HTML control V key preview Okay, so there's our one store, that's the PCs, now is it done there, so all you have to do now is just click on that and put a go and we go back to Amazon and now I'll grab the code for the PCs. Um, key where am I? Back there. So, see, so just underneath, you can put. Oh, oh my pasting's not working tonight. So, just Control V. So, and that's what we. That's the code. So, there's two codes there. There's two different products. Let's see how that comes out. Okay, so that's that's it. Um, and there's a search box there also. So you've got PCs and you can keep, keep on going if you want. You can put more products underneath but uh, that's the easiest way I've been able to uh, do it. Um, it works so that's the main thing. Um, save and publish, sorry. Got welcome, if I remember. Yeah, okay. We'll see where it's got welcome. It comes up as welcome. Uh, we need to finish that. Now, I'll click on settings, just there. And go down to apps. Click on apps. We go down to apps and we click on edit settings. As you can see, it says custom tab name. We put uh, Goldie. Just call your store, whatever you want to call it. I'll just call it Goldie Store. Save that. Um, and I'll just I'll quickly show you, but I'm not going to do it. You can put your little. A photo there and 
if you edit it there, you can see you have to get 111 by 74 pixel uh, and make up a photo, which is a bit technical, but if you look at my other video, it'll show you how to do it. As I said, it's a bit of a, a, a story for a little photo, but um, to make it look good on Facebook, you have to do it. Um, but I'm not going to cover that subject now because it's another subject altogether. Okay, now what I want to show you is where this store has gone. So, Goldie store is on the left. Okay, we keep going um, on the new Facebook. I'm talking about 2016 November Facebook manage sections because it has changed uh, okay so did you see what i done manage sections into apps and manage the sections hold on i'll just move that over okay manage sections because um can i get rid of it oh hello okay did you just see that? I got rid of all those page tips by clicking on the little X and I, so awesome. We have completed the store and you want to have a look what it looks like. Of course you do. Um, the Goldie store's there. Our store, that's the photo you're going to make. And if you want to, if you don't know how to make it, there is a, I, I have got a, um, I'll, I'll put the link to me uh, the first video I made on this and it'll show you how to make that little logo um, and that's it and I hope I've helped you and I will see you later bye <laughs>